Welcome back to Let's Play Darkest Dungeon. I'm your host, Time Pants, and today we are going to be continuing with our wacky runs. We're going to be taking this party here of Ver, Pasto, Forer, Balliol, and Boteller. We're going to have to work on these names. I was thinking first of taking to the, them to the cove, but hear me out. I think we're going to be going to the ruins because I love the synergy here. First off, Unholy Hater. And Satanophobia. Ooh, it's going to be fun, right? We're also going to be taking Pastafuer, who is Ruins Adventurer. He's going to be our prime time damage dealer. And with this, we're really going to be cutting down on a lot of the stress that we might otherwise be eating. Balliol, just, he's going to be our Stunna. And then Boteller, he is going to initiate with a bit of song. And, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, like this for now. We may switch that up and try and uh, take care of some stress later. But I like this party. It lacks healing. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, yes, that's certainly true. So we might indulge a bit more than we otherwise might. Other than that, I think we can go pretty light on consumables. Ah, this is tricky. And we are going to be venturing in the light. Now, hear me out. We're only venturing in the light because, well, they're level zero. We will get into the advanced difficulty levels later. So, let's get started. <coughs> so, as I record this, we are like T minus two and a half hours from the launch of Street Fighter V. So I am trying to record a whole bunch of this because be I am expecting to be indisposed. Alright, so of our noble line. I'm hoping to initiate with a finale. But yeah, I, I feel like if we can get one battle ballot at the start and then go ham. That is not what I intended. And now my entire plan is shot to shit. Well, that that was fast. Um, no, this this should be fine. This is a reminder that it's not enough just to buy the skills. You actually have to have them. That's you know I I just started this game, so I mean a mistake like that is fairly understandable. But I mean we are we are packing on a lot of. Yeah, we are packing on a lot of debuffs here, which is interesting. I don't think it's necessarily a good strategy, but it's certainly an interesting one. And, hmm. Did I, did I mess up? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's fine. I mean, this is definitely not going to be an especially tricky fight, I don't think. Especially with them missing like that, which was something that I definitely planned to do in advance. But here's the thing. So, yeah, nobody responded to my request at the end of the last, um, yeah, at the end of the last run that we had, or the last wacky run that we had, for ideas for the sort of party composition they wanted to see me run. And, you know, that's, that's fine. I, loud and clear, you guys consider me to be one of sort of the elite entertainers of our generation. And you just trust me implicitly Slowly, with whatever gently. decision I make, and I understand that. You know, that's that's fine. There's absolutely no shame in de deferring to the expertise of somebody who's well. As the fiend I don't want to say trained in this, but it is basically what I've awesome. spent my life or dedicated my life to doing. So it is in a way. I definitely Give should have no used absolution. Whoops. All right, so let's get this squared away here. We're going to start with finale. And I like this. So let's see how it goes. I mean, obviously, this is not much of a proving grounds for us. Hmm. This is not much of a proving grounds for us. I hate you. I mean, this is probably okay, but what a waste. I mean, we had the holy water for this reason. But yeah, this is not much of a proving grounds. It's a short mission. And, I mean, fairly straightforward, linear here. We're not going to get to experiment a lot with things like camping buffs, but that's fine. 
I, I do, I mean, there's some obvious synergy here. And, I mean, what we're going to be dealing with stress, stress, and more stress, but we've got ways of mitigating it. And, see ya. Continually there we go. Alright. Is it weapon. worth morphing here? No. Absolutely not. But, guess what? That's not the kind of, that's not the kind of run this is. Of course you more fools! Watch this. This is not the character that I wanted to morph. Oh my lord, this is a nightmare. Yeah, this is definitely not the character that I intended to morph with. <laughs> the hits, the hits keep coming. Push on to the tasks. All right, there we go. Okay, now we got this worked out. Even the cold stone you know, seems bent on preventing passage. Yeah, you, you take take a couple of days off because you know you're trying to kind of rest, recuperate, recharge those creative batteries, which of course are running at 100 percent of their capacity at all times when you're doing a darkest dungeon run. You better believe this guy is gonna get he's gonna get finale first. You better believe that. Hmm. Alright. Annoying, but fine. See ya. Disappointing. Well, I hate that. And now we have a question put to us, but not really. I think it's pretty clear we want to get the damager out of the way. And transform. Do we have a chance to get a kill here? I don't think it's a likely one. Yeah, absolutely not. So, Rage, just get rid of this guy. One stressor is bad, but two is just unconscionable. We can't can't allow that. Well, guess what we're doing next round? Uh, are we in trouble yet? I don't want to say yes, but I might. Yikes. All right. This is not a good start. And remember what I said about this being a proving grounds? Um, it may actually be one now. Um, let's see here. Thank goodness we got the kill. So now we can bash this guy, hopefully. Boy, we're going to be taking a lot of stress here in the next couple of rounds, and I just realized one of the primary weaknesses here is that we don't have any back row reach. Hmm. Might be nice. Might be nice to have that at some point. I was going to say knock him back, but honestly... Maybe I should have just raked. Good grief. It's all falling apart. It's all falling apart. Oh no. What have I done? What have I done? Probably fine. The one time. I wanted to get knocked back. The one time. <sighs> Fear and frailty. Well, is this going well? I think I can pretty clearly say no. Like, absolutely not. No, this is going horribly. And... A devastating blow. A little bit of stress relief would be nice. Okay. Success so clearly in view. Well, that was pathetic. Or is it merely a trick of the light? All right, so obviously we're gonna keep going, but has this experiment failed? Oh god. Um, yes. I mean, it's it's a failed experiment. There's absolutely no question. This was this was not a good party composition. Are we gonna keep running it? You bet your balls. We are going to keep running it. Even if it's not a good idea, we are absolutely going to keep running this party. Because, I mean, I love this because it's just a complete 
glass cannony run, right? You just just beef up and swing, <clears throat> and you beef up and you swing. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> Ask me again in a couple minutes if I think it's a failed. It's a failed experiment. Oh boy, that was lucky. That was very lucky. All right. We need to be fast here. <laughs> like, please, please let us go first. Okay. Um, I think we've got a rake here because I was hoping to get a kill and move this guy forward. And slice off. There you go. All right. This expedition at least promised This success. was This was probably a bad idea. But that's what we brought the food for, right? That's that's just Scout's Scout's motto right there, be prepared. I don't know, is is my issue Is my issue the trinket loadout? I wonder. I mean, our abominations are fine. I'm not worried about their ability to, to keep healthy at all. Like, if worst comes to worst, we just don't morph them. And, hmm. Now that I'm thinking about it, a thought occurs. Alright. Alright, let me think about this. Alright. Alright. Let me think about this. Alright, so you're got, you guys are going to get swung on. No question about that. But I think we go for the stun here. And at the very least, he's out of our hair. And now I think we are in a pretty good position to mop up here on the next round. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Alright. Alright. Uh, I think we vomit on this guy. Oh god, please both take your turns before this idiot goes. Please, okay? You're dead. Okay. What were you worried about? This is fine. This is absolutely, this is 100% fine. This is a genius party. I don't know what anyone else is talking about. This party is going places. Um... Yeah, I regret this immensely, but we're going to keep going. We're doing the whole dungeon because nobody's going to tell us that this is a bad party Spirit except me. Alright, that is clear. my call to make. And I am making the shit out of that call right now. Like, abominations are so good, but yeah, I, I feel like they need some backup. I mean, oof. Oof, that's crazy town. Ancient All right. Traps lie in wait, unsprung and thirsting for blood. This is this is gonna be close, but I mean, unless we get in a fight here, I mean, that's it. We made it. I mean, obviously, there's no fight here because we won the dungeon. All right. Well, what do you think? I wonder if it would actually be better in a longer dungeon, like a medium dungeon, where you can take advantage of some camp- Whoa! Where you can take advantage of some camping skills. Hmm, maybe. We'll have to think about it. Alright, well we're just gonna do a short one today. But, uh, that was, that was interesting. Uh, anybody else? Any bright ideas? Let's see who is joining our merry little band. Okay, this is just something that I wanted to do. All right. Reclusive. This man is more All dangerous right. than he seems. So, four a bombs. What do you think? We'll see. All right. Well, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.